Hi guys, happy Halloween. Today is October 31st and I'm wearing Callie's <laughs> Halloween pumpkin headband because she didn't go to school today because she wasn't feeling well. And you know, I want it to be festive for work. But anyway, I just want to get up here and talk about this pregnancy journey so far. Far. it's very weird it's very surreal because hold on, let me back me up a little bit I feel like I look too close to the camera but it's very surreal it's very weird it's very strange this Saturday I'll be four months pregnant right and it's so weird because number one, I haven't told anybody. Nobody knows besides, of course, my husband. Me and him are the only people that know. So it's just like, it doesn't feel real. It doesn't feel like I'm pregnant. Um, nobody knows, I can't talk to anybody about it. Um, and then I haven't been having many symptoms, which is a good thing because if you know anything about my last pregnancies with my other kids, it was, you know, symptom wise, it was horrible. I was sick the whole entire pregnancy. I'm pretty sure I had HG. And for the beginning of this pregnancy, I was really sick, but it's tapered off now, which is a great thing. But also to me, um, when I'm having symptoms, nausea, vomiting, things like that, it confirms to me that I'm pregnant, if that makes any sense. The way that I feel pregnant is I have a baby bump right like my belly's big I have a baby bump um I can feel the baby moving so the baby's kicking and doing all those kind of things and I'm having symptoms I'm you know nauseous vomiting throwing up um, my sense of smell is very heightened things like that those things confirm to me that I'm pregnant so the fact that I don't have a baby bump you know not yet um I don't feel the baby moving yet because it's still early. I usually don't feel it until around like 20 weeks. So I have, you know, I don't feel the baby moving. I don't have a baby bump. And now my symptoms are like, you know, going away. And it's like, I, I can't talk to anybody about it. It doesn't feel real. Like it's just very weird. It's very strange space that I'm in. It's like, I feel alone kind of in it. Cause I kind of am, but it's just like I can't talk to my friends like I've been wanting to tell people so bad like my friends and my sit my sisters and like my kids and stuff but it's like I can't tell them yet because of course you want to wait like with my other ones I told them quick a month I told everybody but we wanted to of course wait till you're out of the you know safe zone like the first three months usually people wait and then we wanted to tell people in person so we're going to see everybody around thanksgiving so that's when we're going to tell them so it's just so hard because literally i'll almost be five months pregnant and it's just like that's the longest like i've been around my sister multiple times i've been around you know my dad and stuff like that and i just be wanting to tell them so bad like, i just be wanting to blurt it out and tell them but it's just like i'm gonna wait for the right time and things like that but yeah the only thing i really look forward to is doctor's appointments because that's when you know they find the heartbeat or they do the ultrasound or whatever and it like is confirmation for me because for the most part my symptoms are like you know not they're gone which is great but it's just like it just makes me nervous because it's like is the baby okay I'm the only one who's really talking about the baby to myself so it's just like I can't wait to tell people and yeah, I just wanted to come up here with this little update. It's kind of like a long ramble. I'm gonna probably chop it up. But it's actually really cold outside and it's raining. So we'll. I hope we can still go trick or treating later, but we'll see. Halloween 2023, we have beautiful Princess Peach and we have Mario. <laughs> you are so cute. Of course he doesn't want to wear his uh mustache but we took pictures in it he looks super cute and my, my game says boo and his Halloween bucket says boo we just took pictures that's why the ring light is set up and um mine. and Callie's 
Callie's Halloween Bucket lights up. It was a good Halloween. It was raining at first, but then it stopped. So it was really cold, but we all got like enough layers on. And now the kids are asleep. We're over here getting some pizza for dinner. Princess Peach is knocked out. Mario, you can see his hat right there. They are gone. But it's a school night. So we better go home, eat this pizza. They need to take a shower, then they can lay down and get to bed. And yeah, it was a good Halloween. I'm trying to record them when we get home to say how they feel about it. But yeah. <laughs>